Christina from Our Wood Home. As the title of this video says, I'm going to be showing you how to fold a fitted bed sheet. I know this looks a little sped up here, but don't worry, I will slow it down and give a more thorough explanation of what I'm doing to get a nicely folded bed sheet. Um, I don't know about you, but I struggled to fold fitted sheets for the longest time, usually just uh, balling them up and stuffing them in the closet until I figured out this method. So as you can see, it's nice and compact and tidy. So let's get going. The first thing I do is um, just make sure there's nothing stuck in the sheet, like little socks or cloths or anything. So I'll put my hands in all four corners, stretching it out to make sure nothing's in there. And this also helps um, straighten out the sheet. Next, I pick up the two short corners and then fold them together so that you've got a long rectangle of a sheet. Then I fold that in half over my arm so you've got more of a squarish shape. And then we're going to fold that down once again and you can see we've got a rectangle. Now I just roll it into thirds making sure to tuck that in on end under, and then fold it in half again. So this method works for my closet um, because this size fits best on my shelf, but if your shelf is organized differently, you can um, not bother folding it in this last step here. Either way, it's nice and tidy and neat. I'll slow this video down so you can see it again. Once again, you want to start by making sure all the corners are turned out the right way and that there's nothing stuck in the bed sheet. I just put my hands into each corner and poke it out to make sure that it's uh, the way it's supposed to be. Next, I take the two, two of the short corners that would go at the top or the bottom of the mattress and I fold those together. Shake out the sheet to make sure there's no wrinkles and then fold it down towards the bottom of the sheet. You can fold it over your arm, but sometimes it's easier to fold it on a flat surface like the bed or the floor. Now fold the sheet again towards the bottom, so you've got a rectangle. Go ahead and drape that over your arm and roll it into three. You can put it on your shelf in your linen closet just like that if you want, and it's still neat and tidy but I like to roll it once more, uh, or just fold it rather, in half, just to be a little bit smaller and look a little bit neater. This method works really well, it's really fast, um, it works on all sizes of sheets. I'm using a queen size here, but I imagine it would be a lot easier on a smaller sheet. Even still, I think this is a very efficient and quick method, and it does look nice and tidy. I hope you find it helpful.